Hi, my name is Brian Sir with Nutanix, and in this video, we're going to show how to use Nutanix Move to migrate VMs from Hyper-V clusters to Nutanix AHV clusters. I've already logged into the Move interface. Nutanix Move is a small virtual appliance that's available from Nutanix that can be used to migrate workloads to and from AHV clusters. To speed things up, I've already configured a Hyper-V cluster as a source. I've already configured an AHV cluster as a target and we will go ahead and create a new migration plan. A migration plan is a grouping of one or multiple VMs that will control the replication from their source environment to their target environment. We'll get started with the migration plan. We'll give it a name. And if you had multiple sources, you could select them. We just have one source, one target, so they're pre-populated. We'll pick our target container that it'll be replicated to, advance to the next step. Now it shows us all the VMs on the Hyper-V cluster, and we can select them. We must select the target network. We will change the preparation to automatic because we'd like it to do it automatically for us. And now we will enter the credentials for our Linux VM that we're replicating. And we're just going to take the default settings for the rest of it and advance to the next step. It's validating the password that we entered before advancing to the next step. It uses the credentials to retain information such as IP addresses inside the virtual machine. Now it's confirming our summary, which we're fine with, so we will save and begin the replication. Our new migration plan now starts to replicate the image uh, in virtual machines from the source cluster uh, to the target cluster. And then once ready, uh, we can cut over. We already have one uh, that was pre-done, that was ready to go. So if we click the status here, it shows us that it's ready to cut over. So all that we need to do, whether if it was a, a group of VMs, we could select them all, or we could select them individually, and then click the cut over, and it will shut down the source VM, do one last delta replication, and then we'll power on the VMs on the target side, and we're ready to go. Thanks for tuning in. Hope you enjoyed the migration video.